Sometimes the fiercest currents are hidden beneath the calmest waters. And for today's featured star, nothing could be closer to the truth. He's a man who's passed through fire and back again, his soul concealed beneath a stone-cold gaze. Today, we're exploring the secrets of the notorious Stellaron hunter and wanted criminal, Blade. And we're out of time already. See you the next one, folks. Hello, Albert. Miss Kafka, please. I, I didn't mean to offend the Celeron hunters. <laughs> Listen to me. Continue with the program. A great idea, Miss Kafka. Blade is a wind-type character following the path of destruction. He wields a fragmented sword that cuts through all obstacles in his way. His basic attack, Shard Sword, deals wind damage to a single target. Consume a skill point and a set amount of HP to use Blade's skill and initiate Hellscape, which increases damage dealt for a set number of turns. Using this skill does not regenerate energy and won't end the turn. While Hellscape is active, Blade's basic attack is enhanced to Forest of Swords. Forest of Swords consumes a set amount of HP and deals wind damage to an enemy and adjacent targets based on Blade's attack and max HP. Blade's skill cannot be retriggered while Hellscape is active, and using his skill or enhanced basic attack when his HP is too low will reduce it to one. His combat is easy on the eye, but it comes at a cost. In the form of work-related injuries? <laughs> exactly. Luckily, Blady doesn't need to sue. <laughs> when Blade loses HP, he gains a charge, which lasts for a set number of turns. When charges are fully stacked, Blade unleashes a follow-up attack on all enemies and recovers a set amount of HP. The damage dealt is based on his attack and max HP. All charges are consumed after unleashing the follow-up attack. Power comes with a price, but that price can become power in turn. And during exploration, use Blade's technique Karma Wind to instantly attack an enemy. After entering battle, some of Blade's HP is consumed and he deals wind damage based on a set percentage of his max HP to all enemies. When Blade unleashes his ultimate, his inner turmoil is released as his sword lays bare the line between life and death. His current HP is set to 50% of his max HP, and he deals wind damage to a single target as well as damaging adjacent enemies. Damage dealt is based on Blade's attack, max HP, and the cumulative lost HP he sustained during the battle. Remember that this cumulative HP loss has a limit, and the count is reset after every use of his ultimate. Blade may never witness the paradise on the opposite shore, but he's generous when it comes to sending others. Blade consumes his own HP, casts his skill to initiate Hellscape, consumes his HP a second time, and sweeps the enemy away with his Forest of Swords. And the greater the enemy resistance, the more charges Blade accumulates. All attacks that fail to defeat Blade only make him stronger. When charges are fully stacked, Blade brandishes his sword and launches a follow-up attack against all enemies, restoring a set amount of HP in the process. He then uses his ultimate, reducing his HP to 50% of his max HP and sending all enemies to the opposite shore. <laughs> a non-refundable, all-inclusive one-way ticket to paradise. Miss Kafka, were you satisfied with today's program? Very. Although it did kind of sound like someone had a gun to your head. Come on, really? Everything I said was straight from the heart. Including the warm welcome you gave me? Straight from the heart? I'm glad to hear it. So you're interested in paradise. The opposite shore. Perhaps I can arrange for Blade to... Uh, <laughs> on second thought, uh, I fancy a staycation this year. <laughs>